Hey everyone, I'm Sean Morley, and in this video, we're gonna teach you how to hold down a cup board and flatten it with your CNC machine. All right, let's talk about planing this board down here. There's many different ways you can do this. In this scenario, let's just take a quick look at this piece of walnut we've got. You can see right here, it doesn't quite fit. It's a little cupped. Um, if we were to set that right on the spoil board, we'd have too much vacuum leaking out around it. In this case, we've cut a slot out of here, kind of a fixture board. It'll direct a lot more of the vacuum right to it. Now, let's say we're doing a big slab. If you were to go back to look at some of our previous videos, you know, we did the, uh, the uh, entry table and we had a big old walnut slab up here. You might have to shim it. You could block it in different ways. You're just trying to keep that lateral movement from the part going anywhere. In this scenario, this works out really well. I'm gonna go turn the vacuum on and I'll show you just how well it works. All right, I just have zone one open. You can see right here, I can move it around a little bit. If I push that down, we're good, we're set. We'll load up. We've got a two and a half inch Vortex fly cutter here. We'll load this thing up and we'll get to cutting. All right, there you have it. We got our board planed down. Turned out really well. It's good and flat on both sides and ready for our next purpose. You know, this method works out really well. You can see how the vacuum is directed right to this pocket, the part held down without issue. And it's just a good way to do a small part like this. It goes really quick. So for more information, check us out at shopsaber.com. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook and Instagram. Thanks for watching.